Hey guys, in this video I'll be showing you how to make this origami microphone. This was inspired by Miranda Sings. Miranda Sings is a really great entertaining YouTuber. Her channel is um, in the video description below if you don't know who she is. But if you are a Murfanda already, then leave a comment below showing your faces, telling me who you are, and whether you've made this origami microphone or not. And, you know, share a picture if you want as well. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. <laughs> To make the Origami Miranda Sings microphone, you need one square sheet of paper. The sheet of paper that I'm using in this video is a 3 inch square, but you can feel free to use something larger or smaller depending on your personal preference. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to take the square sheet of paper and you're going to fold it in half lengthwise so that it forms a rectangle shape. Crease that in. And then you're just going to unfold. And then take this bottom side over here and align it with the horizontal center crease. So just fold it up there and crease it in like this. Then go ahead and do it one more time. So just take it up there like that to the center crease and crease it in. After that, you just want to rotate the unit and repeat the same thing on this side. So again, you're just going to bring the bottom side up to the horizontal center crease, crease it in, and then do it once more. After that, you want to fold the entire thing in half like this, and then crease it in. Then you're going to open it up like this and then you're going to take notice of these vertical creases right over here. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to lift up this top flap and just the top flap only. So this part over here. And then fold it over diagonally along this vertical center crease so that it forms a triangle shape. Alright, you see that triangle shape right here? And then from the side it should be like this. And from this side, it should look like that. After that, you're going to repeat the same thing on this side. So just lift up this top flap right over here. Just the top one. And then you're going to fold it along this vertical center crease diagonally so that it forms a triangle shape. Alright, so now it should look like this. And like this. After that, you're just going to take this right side over here and fold it over to the left side and crease it in. So you're just going to flatten it like this. And now you should have something that looks like this and like this from the back. So then the next thing you're going to do is you're going to lift this flap over here and then you're just going to lift it up like this and fold it straight up. Crease it in. Once you have this in place, you're just going to rotate it to the side like this so that it's easier to see. And then you're going to take this flap over here and fold it straight up like this. Alright? And now when you fold it straight up, you'll notice that this part gets a little constricted right here. So what you want to do is you just want to fold it straight up. And with your left hand, you're going to push downwards so that it forms this little triangle shape right over here. And then you're just going to crease it in. After that, you just want to rotate the unit and repeat the same thing on this end over here. So again, you're just going to lift this flap over here, fold it straight up along the horizontal center crease, crease it in, and then with your opposite hand, so in this case my right hand, I'm going to flatten to create a triangle shape. So once you've done that, you should have one triangle at the top and one triangle at the bottom. So then you're just going to flip the unit over like this and then you're going to take this side over here and then fold it over slightly to round off the corner like that. And then you're just going to repeat the same thing on the left side. Now you kind of want to make it congruent but if it's not, it's not the end of the world. Alright? So now you have this weird shape right over here. And then the next thing you're going to do is you're going to round off this top right here because it's a little flat. So just fold it over like this. 
and now you can sort of see this like round shape starting to form and then you're just going to fold over this side over here on the right and also this side on the left so that it looks more like a circle just fold it slightly over and slightly over and once you're done you should have something that looks like this and this is your origami microphone so I'm just going to take a black pen over here and I'm going to draw in the um, the metal parts thank you guys so much for watching this origami microphone tutorial inspired by Miranda Sings uh, please hit the subscribe button to be alerted when new tutorials come out and also to check out some of the other Miranda Sings tutorials that I have as well and if you made this microphone be sure to tweet Instagram and Facebook with the hashtag Miranda Sings Origami and you know tweet it to myself uh, tweet it to Miranda so that you know she can see it my social media links are in the video description below I hope you guys have a great day and um, I will see you guys in my next tutorial bye ah. <laughs> that's so silly